I do apologize in the beginning due to different exposures. Amsterdam sun and weather can be a bit unpredictable. Now it's sunny, but it might change again. Let's just get to the video. Welcome to the channel guys, and uh, this week I'm gonna show you a recipe, so we're going back to the old school. And this is the recipe I kinda got inspired from one of the YouTube videos, more specifically when I watched Donald Skihan's challenging sort of food guys with his fridge challenge. So I tried to imitate this recipe there because I like the idea of blending the sauce for the pasta. So what we're gonna do was gonna be greeny mushroom meat sauce. So yeah, let's get to it. So that's what we're gonna cook with. Mushrooms, onions, spinach, garlic, some parsley for some freshness, both stalks and leaves, and pasta. Let's start first with dicing some onions, finally diced of course, then chopping some mushrooms into cube-sized kind of bites. For that we'll need to chop some parsley stalks for some freshness there and let's add the onions and stalks to the frying pan with some olive oil and start frying, caramelizing them off. Put some water with a boil, put some salt and get your pasta in there. Then add your mushrooms to the caramelized onions already, start frying them off so they can become a bit more drier and tastier. Then add your spinach, mix that well so it whittles down. Afterwards, what you have to do is, of course, to season everything. So, but let's add some garlic to that deliciousness. So, salt, pepper. Then, get all your stuff into a little blender with some pasta water. Blend it up. Drain your water. <clears throat> drain your pasta. Keep some water on the side. Then, add your sauce to the pasta in the pan. Toss it all together. And now it's time to plate up. Mm, oh, yeah. Twirl, swirl, yes, baby. Add some parsley to that and grate some parmigiano and Bob's your uncle. Now it's time to eat the deliciousness. Oh my gosh, there's so much sun here. It's... I'm happy about it, but also annoyed because I can't properly expose... expose it, but well, never mind. So, pasta is done. Time to eat it now. So, yep. Hope, guys, that you enjoyed the video. By the way, if you want to add a little bit of oomph there, and oomph is a thing, Google it, you can add some, um, how's it called? A truffle paste. You're gonna add even more umami, even more like oomph to your dish. So, trust me, that's good. So, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please click on the like button, subscribe if you want to see more of this videos in the future, and I'll see you in two weeks. See you guys. Bye.